Hi, this is Ricardo and in this video I will show how to connect an Ableton Link session to your MA2. And while there are many ways of doing this, I found that the most effective one is through um, an executor. This executor, number 15, in my case is connected to Speedmaster 1 and of course I have this learn button over here. I also have an app running on my mobile phone that is Ableton Link enabled and we are all uh, networked so that we are all in the same link session. So if I, I start this clicky thing here, you will see that visually and you, you can probably all also hear the sound. And to connect one thing to another, you come to show cockpit, you add an Ableton link element to your project. If you enable it, you'll see there are already some control events. And if you set its log level to information, you'll see that for each bit on the app, there's a new message here on the bottom saying bit. This element also provides uh, here a, a button. So it's a virtual button that is clicked every time there's a bit. And you can connect it to whatever you want. In this case, I will be connecting to my learn button on the ME2, so I'll need to add the Grand ME2 element, set my credentials for the web remote connection. So we are connected now to ME2, and now we just need to map the executor button from executor number 15, the button number one, to Ableton link tap bit. So you can already see that the the fader here is already moving and you can see that it's, it's following the tempo actually so my my app reads 120 and my speedmaster goes around 120 of course it is averaging at 120 it's the same as if you were clicking uh, in the learn button you will never get perfect 120 so if we increase you will see that the speed also increases and if you decrease you will see that the learn will eventually adjust back to the right to the right speed so I'm now at 106 let's let's make it around 60 which is a very low number yeah so it's 55 59.9, 60, that's already on 60. Let's make it to 100, to 100. And we are on 200 after a few clicks on learn. So this is the most effective way of linking your Ableton link to ME2. If you need more information on this application called Show Cockpit, you can go to the website it's showcockpit.com and there's also a Facebook group that you can join check what others have been doing with showcockpit ask your questions give suggestions uh, feel free to to join this awesome community so thank you for watching and see you on the next video